Oh, well guys, welcome to New Hampshire. We had no snow last week and uh, yeah, now, now they've dumped a crazy amount of snow on us two weeks in a row. So that's really nice. It's really bright outside. Um, I have a guy today coming to look at the 35s, the old 35s. Um, not these obviously, if you're new, like these are 38s. The 35s are over by the garage. Um, coming to look at those later on today. So maybe I'll finally be able to get those sold. Um, they've been posted for like, I don't know, a month and a half or so. And people are like, you know, not really biting on it. And then this guy, Says he's gonna come look at him. He's the first guy that's actually came and looked at him. So, I mean, I don't know if he'll buy him or not, but we'll see. He's coming all the way from Massachusetts, so I mean, <clears throat> we'll have to see. But yeah, it snowed a lot. Um, <laughs> this is kind of like honestly, we didn't get any snow like the whole freaking winter, and now it's like still pretty warm out right now. And it is like March 15th or something, March 14th, and we've just got like a stupid amount of snow. So, <laughs> it's just kind of crazy. Um, we're coming up on 3,000 subscribers though, so if you guys aren't subscribed already, make sure to do so. Um, I think we're at like 2,996 right now, so like four away, like super close. Um, which is pretty sweet. Uh, yeah, so what we gotta do now, truck's gotta get cleaned off. We gotta go dig the 35s out from underneath all this snow um, so that guy can come look at them. If he even shows up, you know, some people just like say they'll show up and they don't, so. But either way, I should probably just go dig them out anyway. I need to find gloves. We need to clean the truck off. Uh, we need to clean the Civic off too, but I'm not gonna make you guys freaking watch me do that because, you know, that thing's boring as hell. But, okay. Really though guys, like this is a freaking stupid amount of snow. I couldn't even see out my rear window. Like, look at this. Oh, I gotta leave it open. Ugh. Look at that. It's right up to the side of the bed. And it even goes taller than it. I gotta shovel this out too. <laughs> Look at this. What the fuck? Oh my god. Yeah, I still, I still really can't even see out of my back window. This has to get chopped down a little. Oh man. Ugh. Right when I thought winter was over, everyone's like, dude, it's supposed to snow. I'm like, no, it's been like 60 degrees, sunny. I don't know why you guys think it's all gonna snow. Oh. And then, you know, two storms later, here I am, packing down all the snow in the bed of the truck so it doesn't go flying out because I'm too lazy to shovel it. <sighs> Yep. I will tell you one thing though. The snow just kind of just like slides right off of here. Like see that? It just like slides right off. On the truck it sticks to the bed liner. So I guess we finally found our first con to bed lining your truck. It doesn't just, you know, like slide off in sheets like it does off of paint. Okay, this is the other reason I hate this car. Holding the trash control button. It's in neutral and don't mind all this fucking trash. Trash control does not shut off in these goddamn cars. Shut off econ mode, oh, it was already off. So like, trash control literally like half the time it shuts off, half the time it doesn't. Like, oh my God. I hate this fucking car. I honestly do. It's great on flat, you know, dry pavement. But the second there's any snow, the trash control doesn't decide, it, it, won't, it won't shut off. Like this is the dumbest invention ever. Honda, what the hell were you thinking? 
it'll shut off when I'm driving. Like if I just like accidentally hit it with my knee when I'm driving, oh, it shuts off. But when I, when I need it to, no, 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 definitely not. This is honestly why I just need to get like a different daily driver because I, I, uh, I, I thought winter was over. Like I was so close to just like going in and trading that thing for like a Subaru or something. But I was like, oh no, nah, you know, the weather's getting nice, you know, I'm not gonna need all wheel drive. Little did I know. This is honestly the fucking stupidest car I've ever driven. It is so dumb. Look at it, look at it, look at it, look how dumb it is. My God, I will never buy another one of these freaking things again. Oh my God, this thing pisses me off, guys. It seriously pisses me off. Like, it's just going back and forth right here. Completely fucking ridiculous. Completely fucking ridiculous. It's literally not stuck on anything. And it wouldn't be stuck either. It, it would not be stuck if it would just let me shut the traction control off. But it won't let me shut the traction control off. I fucking hate this thing. I seriously do. This thing makes me so mad. Won't let me shut the traction control off. Just won't let me do it. So I'm stuck going forward and backward with it not letting me give it any power. Like, and someone in the last video said shut eco mode off. Yeah, well, it honestly makes no difference at all. As you can see, it doesn't do anything. Now we're, we're actually, we actually might even be more stuck now. Good fucking Lord. Yeah, now we're even, all right, I'm pulling this fucker out with the truck, fuck it. Like this was already plowed once yesterday and the thing's fucking stuck on, what the hell my door's locked to? Literally it's stuck on like nothing. Oh, I'm gonna teach this stupid Honda, you know. You don't get stuck on flat ground. Not around here. I think if I pull a little bit more, it'll straighten it back out. It'll just like slide this right over. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, there we go. That's how you park your Honda, guys. You just pull it where you want it. You know, while we're doing this, I wonder if I can uh, e-brake turn this some bitch right around. Oh, no, that didn't work. You know, guys, I honestly do hate this car, though. I honestly hate this car. Cause now we gotta try to get it up into the other driveway so that we can plow down there. Now I gotta hit it with some speed and just freaking go for it. And I guarantee you we're not gonna make it. Ugh. Oh, we made it. Whew. I had to go all the way down the driveway and get a running start though. I went all the way out to the road, got a running start and came all the way back. And look at it, we just slipping the whole way. One of these days though, I am gonna go trade that goddamn thing in for something with all wheel drive. Um, I don't know though yet what I really wanna do. Cause like it's, I, I have to drive like 500 miles a week. So with that car. So I like, I like the, the gas mileage of it, but if you get stuck in the snow, you're fucked. So I don't know. 
But now we gotta go dig out those tires for, yeah, the rims and tires for that guy that wants to come look at them. And uh, yeah, they're gonna be buried under a whole bunch of snow. So that should be fun. Well, they're not super buried, but I do gotta get them out of here. So, God damn, look at all this freaking snow. This is literally two storms, guys. Ridiculous, it's like almost as tall as my truck. But, uh, we're gonna set you guys down right here in this nice, uh, you know, camera holder on top of this here Lincoln Continental. I swear there's a Lincoln under here. Well, I feel like this is a pretty good representation of how much snow we've gotten. Um, Cause these were laying right on the ground. So that's a 35 inch tire. <laughs> Whew, that's a lot of snow. All right, well, tires are out of the snow now. <sighs> so now if that guy actually shows up, I don't want to dig him out while he's here. All right, guys, I got her in four low right now. Let's see if we can make it through the trail we went down the other day with even more snow now. Whew. Four low in this thing is super, like, like it's, it's like a crazy low range. It seriously is. Like, it has so much torque in four low that if you give it too much gas on, like, drive dry like dry dirt or whatever it basically feels like you're gonna like jump to the moon so <coughs> all right so this is the part where I'm kind of a little bit oh shit put the wipers on and of course oh we're not getting stuck today boys don't you worry we'll just pin her at three grand and four low and we'll just fucking hit the bitch here we go here we go oh fuck <laughs> Shit, I know you guys couldn't see anything right there. <laughs> All right, let's go back and look at the carnage on that. <laughs> Holy shit. I stopped for a second, which I really shouldn't have stopped. Look at these ruts, guys. That's like, oh, that's freaking deep. I stopped up here and I shouldn't have. And, uh, to turn the wipers on <laughs> and then I started slipping so I just basically like gave it the gas we were rubbing bottom right here actually no there's no fucking way what, were, what was hitting right here looks like that's like the skid plate for the like transmission like the transmission mount we'll go look and see if I was rubbing on there but yeah I started to slip so I just gave it all it had and uh I crawled right through guys and this is deep like literally this is like this this side's deeper actually this is like some deep stuff so i honestly think the 35s i would get stuck out here with the 35s but and then the end dude this is freaking crazy deep like this is some deep snow and it even turned when <laughs> over <laughs> Oh, you can see my rim was rubbing right there. It went right over the snow pile. Oh, you know, I bet you that was just my front diff that was rubbing. You know what I mean? Like, oh no, we got some snow up in there. <laughs> we got plenty of snow up in here. Yeah. Yeah, so my, my, no, my front diff was rubbing. That's what that was, but. Anyone want a, uh, you know, pre-snowed frame rail? 25 cents, one owner. Yeah, as you guys can see too, in the last video, you know, when I did these little tire letter things, I haven't done the second coat yet because like, it's all wet. Um, after you let it sit for a day though, it actually does look like it belongs on there, but I still gotta do the second coat on this side. And then the other side, I, I didn't put any on yet, but. So yeah, the, the truck will go through that, but the Civic gets stuck on half an inch of 
pack down snow with tar like <laughs> i swear to god i hate that car i hate that car so much anyway guys hopefully you enjoyed this video uh, i know we didn't really didn't do a whole lot but bombing through the snow over there was fun so yeah leave a like i'm gonna do more stuff like that in the future guys um i kind of like well can't do it today so some some point in the future i really just kind of want to like take it easy on the truck you know like not go flying through shit every day breaking stuff you know what i mean i kind of i've always kind of taken it a little bit easier on the truck so and i just don't want to get stuck like if that were to happen to me like out on a trail and not at my house um and i actually got stuck that would not be a good day so <laughs> yeah we will be doing stuff like that when the freaking weather gets better guys when the weather gets better and we don't have a civic that gets stuck and we have mud up to here instead of snow up to here we'll have a whole lot more fun um snow is fun too but i mean hey mud is a lot more a lot more fun except mud gets in freaking everywhere and then you have to clean it but yeah anyway guys like i said we are here i'll give you a, i'll give you a live count actually as to uh how many subscribers are at right now all right so it's the same as like half an hour ago or whatever 2996 so um yeah i mean we didn't hit 3k yet but that's that we're sort of like super close also guys if you want to follow my instagram my snapchat um i've got two instagrams one of them is a page where you can send in your own trucks to be featured um and we're doing like a truck versus truck thing over there right now, which is actually kind of cool. So if you want to part, uh, partake in that, you can go follow that one, follow my regular one in my Snapchat also. Um, I've always got tons of stuff up there throughout the day. So yeah, alrighty guys. And you get, you know, and you know like what I'm gonna post a video to. So yeah, alrighty guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe. See you guys in the next one. Thank you all for watching.